Welcome to the wonderful world of chemistry. Today, with the help of the thermal effects set by Mel Chemistry, you will learn that calcium chloride can both freeze and heat water. You could say calcium chloride is a thermal chameleon. Perform this experiment on a plastic tray to contain any possible spills. Don't forget to put on protective gloves and goggles before doing the experiment. To open a bottle containing a reagent, push the cap down and turn it. Pierce the bottle nozzle with an unbent paper clip. For the thermal chameleon experiment, you will need two bottles of calcium chloride, one plastic vial, a thermo sticker, a plastic stirring rod, a 5 milliliter syringe without a needle, a cork stand, crushed ice, water, and some coins. Take the cork stand from the starter kit and pour approximately 2 milliliters of water into the center using the syringe. Put the plastic cup, approximately half filled with crushed ice, onto the water puddle on the cork stand. Notice how you can easily lift the cup off of the cork stand. Pour one bottle of calcium chloride into the cup with ice. Mix the contents for two minutes. Now try to lift the cup, first on its own, and then weighed down with coins placed on the cork stand. The cup will lift together with the cork stand and the coins because the mixture has cooled down and the cup has actually frozen to the stand. Water and ice consist of the same molecules but behave rather differently. In frozen water, the molecules are like in a crystal. That is why the ice is solid. When water is in its liquid state, the molecules move freely and easily dissolve the calcium chloride on the contrary to the molecules frozen in the ice. So for the calcium chloride to dissolve, part of the ice needs to thaw and go to its liquid state. Heat from the environment is required for this. The plastic cup and water on the cork stand are the environment in our case. When the mixture takes away the heat, the temperature of the cup and the water decreases. This is why the cup freezes to the cork stand. Now take a plastic vial and attach a square thermo sticker onto it. Using the syringe, add two milliliters of water to the vial and pour all of the calcium chloride from the second bottle into it. The mixture in the vial will heat and the thermo sticker will become bright red. When calcium chloride dissolves, it emits heat. That is why the temperature of the mixture increases and the thermo sticker changes its color to red. The result of these two experiments proves that calcium chloride is indeed a chameleon. It both increases and decreases the temperature of water as it dissolves. However, the decrease in temperature when calcium chloride is added to the ice is much greater than the increase in temperature and it doesn't prevent the cup from freezing to the stand. Learn more about this experiment on our Mel Science website.